Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today, let me tell you, we're going back to an old so video. So comfort wise, this is horrible. This is, actually, this is probably the worst underwear I've tried. That's this one, as you can this, see. You can tell by the title of this video, I'm revisiting the Moschino underwear to see if I made a mistake. We're gonna retry it. I got another pair of their pants to try. It's not you, it's me kind of moment. Let's see if that's what happened to this brand. Okay, so. First up we have, well first up, this is the only up we have. What am I saying? <laughs> I'm already losing it. Okay, so I bought one pair of underwear from TK Maxx or TJ Maxx, wherever you want to be based in the world that, that that comes from. I picked up these and I thought, you know what? For like seven, eight dollars, I'm gonna try it one last time. So this is what they look like. That's what they look like, okay? Trying these on, these, I'm just not impressed. Like, and search nine twain. That don't impress me. Because these are so effing tight. This is a size medium. And yet again, I am let down by this because it's so tight on the legs. It's a beautiful color with a nice band. This is their basic range. So, I honestly can't say too much. It's super constrictive on the leg, like here, where it shouldn't be. It should be nice, relaxed fit, a decent so it doesn't ride up. Oh, it doesn't ride up because it's too busy but it constricting your legs pretty much. So this is so tight on. I really don't recommend Moschino. <sighs> Guys, I've just had it, like. <laughs> Moschino is not the one. I'll tell you the pros. Right, let's go in with the pros because the pros are beautiful material. It's a really soft cotton. Nice band, it's meh, it's 50-50. It's sharp at the, at the top, but like not bad when it's on. The seam placement's quite right for this underwear. It's supportive on the front, nice support, but the rest is horrible. Like the top here is abrasive and it's kind of sharp on the hand. It's just so tight on for a UK medium. It shouldn't be this tight. Like, I don't know what's up with it. For the price point, getting it for like six pounds and eight dollars, it's not bad, but paying full price, which is the range from 30 to 40 for this, I'm not there. I'm not, I don't think it's something anyone should waste their money on. Like Calvin Klein does way better designer style underwear and so does like H&M which collabed with this and made a way better underwear for such a low price point. I honestly can't believe that like this is actually horrible like that's it. Reviews over guys pretty much Moschino is a no don't waste your hard on cash on it. I would prefer to buy something like from H&M to be honest because they actually made the underwear way better and so much nicer fitting so don't even think about asking for something else from Moschino because it's like the Titanic and it's sunk and it's gone. Jack has literally left the building and Rose is on her little door and that's just the story that's just happened. I hope you enjoyed this video as brief as it is you know, this is a trunk and it's not a brief, but yeah. Make sure to smash that like button and help the channel grow more and get it higher up on the algorithm again. And make sure to leave a comment down below what like underwear you'd like to see next, I guess. And what you thought, if you've ever tried this underwear, like what's your thoughts on it. Make sure to subscribe for more content, turn that notification bell on, and be notified of when my next video comes out. Thank you guys for your continued support all the way to 2020. I love you guys so much and I hope you have an awesome day wherever you may be. Bye bye So the video you're just watching has just ended, but don't worry, you can go watch one of my old videos right here, or you can go and subscribe right here, and be notified when my next video comes out so you don't have to miss any of the action. So thank you, and goodbye.